Hey guys, it's Krista. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, so I'm going to hop on today and do a haul video. I did receive an order in today. Um, it's a small order. It's just something I wanted to get. Um, there was a few items I wanted to restock on. Um, and this order is from Wicked Essence. I'll leave the shop linked below. Um, I'm just looking at my invoice here. So I picked up four items. She just had a recent restock and she, meaning Ashley, the owner of Wicked Essence. Um, I'll leave this shop linked below if you guys are interested. Um, so I've ordered from this shop, I don't know, maybe two or three times now. And I've had really good luck with the melts that I've picked up. So I really do enjoy this vendor. Um, so she had a restock recently. It was a very small restock, but there was... How many were there? There was like three or four cents that I already tried from her that I really liked. So they were getting like uh, poured again. So I decided to order some ones that I've already tried, but I love them. They're so delicious. Um, but then I did get one new scent. So let me just reach in and grab everything out of here. There's three samples. Sorry for all the noise. <laughs> okay, that's everything. But it came with this really cute... Oh, and then there's this as well. Let me grab that. Came with this really cute, like, star tissue. I'll probably save that and send it um, in some happy mail to a friend. Um, so, yeah. So, I have my invoice here. And then it... Usually, her orders come with these. It's like a little... Like a little scratch card. So, you can scratch it, get a discount for your next purchase. Um, and then I did get, like I said, three... Three samples. So the first sample I did get with my order is this one, which is Lavender Patchouli Stress Relief. And this one's really good. To me, it really smells kind of like spa-like. It's really funny. This, this scent actually takes me back to um, when I went to school for aesthetics. I was in beauty school. Um, and so going to school for aesthetics, you learn like skincare, you learn makeup, you learn like body treatments and all that stuff. So this smells, it takes me back to like some products we used to use in beauty school. It's just kind of funny. It just takes me back. That's just like a scent memory. It's really pretty though. Um, it does have the patchouli in it, which I'm not, it's not that I don't like patchouli, just some blends that I've tried with patchouli, they haven't been my favorite. So I feel like I'm kind of like, I'm still on the hunt for some scents with patchouli that I will actually like. I don't know, but this one's really pretty. This one I do like, and it's something new to try. Um, this one, I actually have a full size of it in a snap bar. This one is cranberry lemon zucchini, which is zucchini bread, warm cranberry and lemon glaze. This one's delicious. I actually haven't melted this one yet, but just, just on cold though, it smells so good. Oh my God, it's so pretty. You literally get every note in here. Like you get that zucchini bread. Yeah, you get that um, like delicious, juicy kind of cranberry note, but then you get like that tart lemon. Oh my God, it's such a pretty like fruity bakery scent. So I definitely recommend. I mean, I obviously haven't melted mine yet, but on cold, it smells absolutely delicious. Um, and then my next sample is this one, which is Love Spell Cotton Candy Lavender Apple Blossom. And this one smells, it smells really pretty. It kind of smells like a body spray or something. Like it smells very feminine. I think it's just because it's the love spell. It just makes me think, yeah, it's a body spray. That's obviously, you know, love spell is a perfume type. So I guess that makes sense. But it's really pretty though. It does smell really nice with the apple blossom and like you get a touch of that sweetness from the cotton candy. So this one I might actually pull in for this week because it's green and this week is like green melts. So I might pull that in and try it. I don't know, we shall see, but it smells really pretty, really nice. Kind of like feminine and, feminine and like kind of um, body care, perfumey kind of. It's really pretty though. Okay, so I'll start first with the like little like shape and then I'll go into the snap bars. So this is a shape that I received, or no, actually this wasn't from, 
I got this shape back when I placed, I think my second order. Um, and this was one that was offered and I did buy it. I liked it. So I ordered it again because it was available. And that's this one, which is to the moon and back. And the notes on this one are pink sugar, strawberry, and coconut cream. Um, and it's in this cute little like moon, like little moon shape. This one is so pretty, you guys. Uh, her coconut cream is so delicious. I love it. If you like coconut, I recommend trying a blend of coconut cream from her, like a blend with coconut cream, or I think she sometimes will sell the coconut cream by itself. It is just the prettiest coconut scent, but I love the pink sugar. And then you do get a touch of that strawberry. This is just so pretty. Oh, uh, yeah. So I saw this available in the shape, so I just decided to get the shape of it. Um, I might have to keep it my eyes peeled though. If that one's ever offered in like one of these like snap bars or something, I will probably get it because I really enjoy that scent. So let me start first with this um, snap bar. This is one that I have not tried. And the next two are ones that I have tried. So this one is like absolutely stunning. And this one is Bum Bum Bamboo orchid and amber oh my god it's so pretty you guys you get a touch of that bamboo so it's like a fresh type of scent but there's still like kind of like that body care i think that's from the boom boom i've never had a blend with orchid in it so i don't really know like what I mean, orchids a floral, but this isn't like super powdery floral or anything to my nose. It's very kind of like, like body care, fresh and feminine. That's all, that's like the only thing I could think of to describe it. It's lovely. It's really pretty though. I like this one. This will be a nice one, I think for like springtime. Yeah, I really like that one. And I just wanted to try it. It sounded really good. All right, and the next two are ones that I've had before. Um, actually, I, I still have some of them in my collection, but I just love these scents so much that I just wanted to get more just so I don't like run out. Um, this one is a snap bar in Salty But Sweet. And this one is like a pretzel scent. Oh my God, it's like a cinnamon sugar pretzel scent. It's delicious. This one is cinnamon sugar, baked crust, powdered sugar, and pretzel. Oh my God. It's so delicious, you guys. Like this just makes my mouth water. I just wanna like take a bite out of it. Oh my God. It's definitely like yeasty. So if you guys aren't into like that yeasty pretzel, I probably wouldn't recommend, but if you're into like the yeasty scent, you don't mind it and you love a pretzel, you need this in your life. I am not even kidding you. It's so, so delicious. I'm obsessed. So she was offering it in the snap bar, so I did get it in the snap bar. I probably should have gotten like two of these, but um, I have another pack of like little donuts in this scent, so I figured just get the snap bar. You don't need, you don't need five. One is fine, but I love this pretzel scent. It is absolutely delicious. Um, and then this next one is Hug in a Mug, which is mulled cider, spiced orange, hot cranberry tea. And it's funny, when I did an empties video recently, I melted this one. I forget like what the basket was where I pulled this, but I finished, I finished one of the melts of this. And I remember in my empties video, I was saying how like, you know, I think for right now I'm good. I don't need any more. And here we are. I ordered a snap bar of it because I just... She was offering it, it's in the snap bar, which I honestly, like if I'm able to get this shape from anyone, I would almost prefer this shape just because it's just so convenient to like snap off a piece, put it right in your warmer. Um, like there's no chopping involved. So I was like, you know what? We're just gonna go for it. I know I said I didn't need any more, but I do, I need more. <laughs> so this one, like I said, ha um, hug and a mug. Um, it's just a really pretty scent. So this is what this one looks like. It did break in transit, but I'm not worried about it. This one to my nose, if you guys have tried Winterberry Apple Tea from Scentsy, that's what this smells like to me. 
And I'm not gonna say it's like spot on winterberry apple tea because it's not. Like it's 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 its own scent, but it just gives me those vibes, like that cozy tea scent with the cranberry and like the apple notes. Oh my god, I love it. So if you're a fan of winterberry apple tea. And like, you know, maybe you're wanting to try out a new vendor or something. If you're wanting to try Wicked Essence and you like Winterberry Apple Tea, if they have this in stock, I recommend. I recommend trying it because I just, I absolutely love this scent. And I've ordered it multiple times now. It's just a really pretty like tea. It's cozy. It's comforting. It's just a really pretty tea scent. I just will continue to order it because I love it. But that is my order. Very, you know, short and sweet. Um, but I just wanted to kind of share this because I feel like I haven't shared too much, like too many orders from Wicked Essence. I don't know why. I guess I just, you know, had stuff going on in life and I just never got around to filming them. Um, but I just wanted to share this one. So love my stuff. I'm always very happy with my orders. Um, so I will leave everything below. Um, and sometimes she does run like sales, like a discount. Um, but most of the time it's just... You know, she'll have her shapes in stock. You can kind of, I feel like that's another thing too, is that there's always something available in her shop. So, you know, I know sometimes shops do like a ready to ship and then they kind of, you know, take it off the site. After so long, like this stuff, like this uh, shop, anytime I go to her website, there's always something available. So just, I'm just throwing that out there in case anyone is interested, I will link the shop below. But I just... I found out of this shop from Angela of For the Love of Sense on YouTube. And ever since then, I've just been really pleasantly surprised and really enjoying everything that I've ordered. So yeah, I just wanted to hop on and share this little haul video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Very short and sweet, but yeah, I just wanted to share my goodies. But I hope you guys have a great night. Thank you so, so much for watching my video. Have a great week ahead, and I'll see you guys soon in another video.